Alrighty then. We've successfully amputated our fingers. How about that? Is this... I think that's where we came from. Yeah, that's where we came from. Alright, let's go. Ew! Look at that shot. I'm holding the walk faster button, and he's not walking very fast at all. Oh. This place what the fuck is that? Better. Strange skull. Yeah, that's fucking strange, alright. Okay. Are you serious? Now I gotta find a fucking key card. Yeah. <laughs> See what's over here. Oh, there's a lot of stuff, huh? Open sesame. Oh, look at this guy. He's a looker. He's pretty. Nice. To Okay, let's check this out. Oh, we found the key card. There's another one. Oh, there's another one over there too. Why the hell did you need to pull it all the way out to get this piece of paper? Anyway. Name of deceased, Sarah Smith. Date of death, February 24th, 1952. I hereby certify that I attended deceased... I attended... Yeah. I hereby certify that I attended deceased from March 8th, 1951 to February 24th, 1952. And last saw her alive on February 24th, 1952. Um, so, wait a minute. So he, two February 24th, 1952, and he saw her, last saw her alive on February 24th, 1952. So, the last day that he attended her, he also saw her alive. Let's read on. Cause of death, severe lacerations to the abdomen, intr intra abdominal injury subsequent blood loss if death was due to external cause violence fill in also the following accident homicide or homicide suicide or homicide excuse me i can't read homicide manner of injury laceration by sharp implement possibly fingernails additional notes please use the box provided overly for any additional Relevant information. Signed by N. Bowen, M.D. Address, Blackwood Sanatorium. Date, February 24th, 1952. Additional notes. Body was not discovered until six to eight hours after death. Sections of the intestine and kidney were apparently eaten by the attacker. Ew. That's fucking gross. Okay. Anyway... Another one right here. And there's apparently nothing on this one. I had to look over. I thought I forgot to unmute my mic. That would have sucked. Uh, no, this isn't the only thing. I guess there's something there. The emergency medical tag named Nicholas Bowen. Tag date, February 24th, 1952. Description, attack by inmate, fatal lacerations to the throat. Wait a minute. So Bowen is the guy that took care of the girl that we just read about. She was found dead on February 24th, 1952. This guy had a tag, a deceased tag, from February 24th, 1952. So he died the same way he found her, or... Er, he died, excuse me, the same day that he found her and filled out the deceased paperwork. Uh, Alright, that's interesting. 
That is quite interesting. Well, we can go through this door now. So, he found, he worked with a patient until February 24th, 1952, found her dead on February 24th, 1952, filled out paperwork for the deceased, and then immediately died afterwards and got tagged. Great. Sounds like a lot of fun. Creepy wheelchair, awesome. They didn't make us do a quick time event in that section. So we're back to the chapel. Right. Back in here. Ah, I see. We're back in the main area, so we looped around to get the key card. Learned all that lore. Pretty cool stuff. Now we can get in here. Nice. Oh shit! Uh, oh, the the totem. I'm not gonna hit the wolf. Easy boy. Easy. Easy. That's a good one. Aha! Let's approach him. The totem, it's okay, we can do it. That's a good boy. That's right. He's got a lot of balls approaching a wolf. Yeah, good boy. Yeah. Good guy. You like that? Yeah. And everyone likes a little loving, right? Nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, so he didn't fucking kill us. Hey, guy. What the hell? You like that? Yeah. I don't want to do everyone that again. Likes a little loving, right? Oh, I see a shiny. Uh, so another shiny. Stash exposed. Cigar box. So yeah, there was a fucking... Where was it at? Uh, yeah, this right here. Oh, look at that. Update. The label has the same as the cigar found in the sanatorium. Alright. Butterfly effects, character info, twins, 1952. Got a lot of clues in this sanatorium. Alright, what was this? Oh god, what's gonna come out of here? Back in the way. Oh. Bones? Maybe this will keep the wolves fat and happy. Give it to our little wolf buddy. We made a friend. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Easy, boy. We gave the dog a bone. Knack knack patty whack, we gave a dog a bone. Alright, let's check this. There's no oh, there actually is something here. So a jacket. What have we here? It's a gun! We need that fucking gun. Take the gun, dude. Oh yeah. <laughs> Right, we got ourselves a piece now, son. Fucking freak. What the hell? Local man found dead. Footprints found. Bigfoot sighted. Fourteen missing in mountains. What the hell is all this? Somebody's doing some serious studying. Is there anything else in this place? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Alright, let's check the door. Oh, that's gonna be fucking loud. He's gonna see you or hear you. Whatever. He exits this way, apparently. Light switch! Flip it! Another staircase. This fast walk really is not that fast at all. I'm holding the button down right now. He's not walking very fast at all. Looks like we got a totem. Oh shit! Hold on. That's Mike with a lighter. And he blows up? Huh, I can't tell exactly where that is. We're gonna have to be super, super careful. So I do not want Mike to die if he doesn't have to. This is the Miracle Man, the successful rescue of all 12 miners trapped in the disaster of the 5th of January, 1952. So they actually got all the miners out. Let's check the corner before we go downstairs. Nothing. Alright, let's head downstairs, see what's down here. I'm starting to get a little nervous now because we've been getting a lot of these totems that show characters dying, and I don't really want any characters to die if I don't have to. If I can fucking save them all, I definitely want to. goes this way, I guess. Of course. Locked. Gotta shoot another lock. What are you doing? Why are you... Oh, getting it out of the way, I guess. Okay. Oh! Flamble looking great. What the hell? 
Uh, hey, Creeper, how are you? Dude's watching us all. Alrighty then. Interesting, so it's starting to get very, very, very interesting now. I'm sorry, that was probably really loud. But the story's really starting to pick up. I'm liking it.